Good evening, I'm Days J2, and we're going to continue to play Resident Evil Zero. And we have left off um, with us finding a battery. And, um, oh, didn't mean to do that. Yet, I keep doing it. Um, we found ourselves a battery. And um, I have no idea what it's going to be used for. But we're going to switch back to him and see where he can take us next without running into that fucking <laughs> yucky enemy, which I know is going to be right out here. Oh, he was! He was raining right out there! Uh, oh, come on! Get out of my way! Ah, uh, this is not good. <laughs> this is not good. <laughs> well, that's what happens when you mess with the freaking monster there. <laughs> um, so I'll be right Resident back because I can't remember where I saved. Zero. So see you in a minute. <laughs> All right, so I'm back. Now, I did a little bit of ex experimenting or something like that. And it's best not to piss him, uh, the slug man off. However, I did go back and grab my shotgun and some ammo. Now, it's not a lot of ammo, but it's something. So, uh, let's get through this and run past him and don't worry about him. Because in the end, he's just going to grab onto you and make life miserable for you. So it's best to just ignore them. Mm. Um, so, however, I did stumble upon this room while I was moving around. I didn't see the other room yet, but and I haven't explored this room completely. I just kind of wanted to see where this leads to. But, however, there are zombies in here. And they're quickly dismersible, like usual. Um, I don't know what's... Ooh, more shotgun ammo. That will be useful for stacking. Okay. Um, however, I don't know what else is in here. And I still haven't figured out what um, the battery is for yet. A handle. Okay, so a handle's missing in here. But as I was saying, there's a battery that we have, and I still haven't figured out what that's for. And I'm hoping maybe one of these rooms will answer that. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Rebecca took a bit of damage, but she's doing okay. She's hanging in there. Let's see what's in here. Hopefully not, nothing too bad. Uh, we got a first aid spray, which will come in handy. And some handgun ammo, which would be nice. Um, let's see what she's doing. Okay, they're about even right now as far as ammo goes. Although, I should probably give some to her because at least he has shotgun ammo. So, yeah, let me do that real quick. And give her some of my pistol bullets. Alright. This looks no more than a ammo or a this looks nothing more than just a supply room by what it seems like. Um, interesting. Okay. 
I kind of had really high hopes for this room, but it doesn't seem to have anything in it. Um, that that would be useful. Oh, crap. Oh, wrong button again. <laughs> All right. So it seems I've ran out of places to go, in a way. Oh wait, hold on. Bring that that back. Again, excuse me. Oh yeah, that was that one area I haven't I didn't got bother going in because of Worm Man. Or whatever the hell his name is. So it's a little difficult wearing this. <laughs> For some odd reason. Uh, I guess she can use the first aid spray. She does need it. Alright. So now we're in good condition. I just hope that I didn't use that pre preemptively! Holy crap! <laughs> uh. Oh god! I Christ. Uh, which uh, which room did I go in? Is it the more important room? <laughs> uh, belong to destroy of use. Which is something but they belong to terrier of use. Uh, enough window here. Okay, so English for nothing useful. She's already down to danger again. Uh. Oh. Uh, let's see what's here. Of course, it's the handle that I need. So, let's try, Ow. oh, I can just reload, and then, oh, my shotgun, though. <laughs> and then I should have another sod available. There we go. Equip my pistol back. All right. Now this, we got to bust our ass to the other room. In the hopes that she doesn't get hurt. Uh, or him! <laughs> uh, God! Stop getting in my way! I need to get through. Uh, I don't see this going well. I just don't. <laughs> Everything seems to be going very wrong. <laughs> uh, all right, so let's use that. Hmm. Obedience tablet. What do I need that for? Obedience is described. What? What in the world do I need that for? Okay, I have two 
items that I have no idea what they're for. One's a battery and the other is something else. I don't know what the hell. And they're both close to dying. I won't be surprised if they actually do die. <laughs> Come on, this... Oh god. Oh, she died. <laughs> uh, this so... It took so long to get there. It took so long. Hmm. Well. Shit. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about that. Okay, well, I'll be right back. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, I'm doing a different section, which is which involves lighting the candles, and I looked up a wiki, a wiki, a wiki, um, for this puzzle, and I believe it, I believe it said, deer, wolf, horse. Um, cougar. Snake. And then eagle. Oops. <laughs> Was in the front of it, I guess. There we go. All right, so I don't I don't know where you were supposed to find that, but I don't really care at the moment. I kind of want to find out what's going on around this area and see if this is a much safer area to go to. Um, guess we'll find out. Well, there's a bottle. Not sure of what. Screwed wooden desk. Drawers appear to be of ransacked. Ooh, there's something here. Fireplace appears to be purely decorative. Yes, but there's something there. Unity. A unity statue. That's kind of interesting. Because that uh, one other place had obedience. Excuse me for my farts. <laughs> Don't know why that's going on. But I'm going to put this here as well as the Molotov cocktails because I don't really need them um try to oh come on come on <laughs> it's such bullshit all right we got the obedient or the unity tablet and I guess going through that one area you get the obedience tablet and I'm not sure what these tablets are for I think they're for an earlier area that we passed through, but I'm not entirely sure on that. Um, so there's one more room to check out and see what's going on in. So let's do that real quick. Because I'm not exactly sure how much longer I have on this section or this episode since I've been really screwed up on the, on this one. I think I got I think I got a few more minutes left. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, okay. Am I kidding anybody? Okay. Oh no, he's getting back up. Okay. All right. Management trainee diary. What is? What is it? What is it that Director Marcus is researching all the time? <laughs> and what's with his weird interest in leeches? Interest seems more like love at times. Rumor has it that there's something dangerous about those leeches. It is true that when Dennis just touched one, he got ill with a fever. Again today, there were those horrible moans beyond that door. Let sleeping dogs... No way I'll go near them. Even if the director ordered me, I don't want to end up like Dennis. That poor bastard. Scratching and scratching makes me itch just watching him. 
Jost watching him. <laughs> Must maybe go if can, but who? Dennis gone. I go. Hungry. Help, Mom. That's an interesting depiction of what's been going on. Uh, Spire matches sheets are both missing. Okay. It's a wooden box. Inside are various gadgets and gizmos. Huh. A simple bed. Mattress and sheets are both missing. Things in here, but nothing, nothing eye-opening. Not like it goes anywhere either. Hmm. Oh, it's just showing me the stuff that I left behind. All right. Well, unfortunately, that didn't lead to anywhere or anything good. Kind of a memento to the guy that got eaten, or something. Which, this of course means I'm gonna have to go, I'm gonna have to go through that blue room, which I'm not excited about. <laughs> not at all excited about. And I really gotta figure out what is in this case, or how to get it open, rather. And there's absolutely no clues on how on how to open it. Um, appears to be wrong. I wish there was some clue. It's locked via a combination lock. Looking closely, you notice the number is three eight five written. What? It was on the freaking case the whole time. <laughs> three. Eight, five, I'm gonna be really upset. Oh my god. What? <laughs> There's something inside. Took the handgun parts. Oh, great. <laughs> the hand would greatly increase the gun's firing precision. Wow. <sighs> That's just, wow. <laughs> Screw you! Uh, Standard equipment is a nine per. Oh, that's. That's just infuriating. Standard issue. Oh, that's just. Ah! Uh, I can't believe that happened. Uh, custom to bust him. <laughs> okay. Well. Well. Now, it's. It said it would help with firing precision. And I don't know what exactly that means. But. That God, that still pisses me off. It was right on the case the whole time, but yet I have no idea where the Magnum is, and it was giving me that option pretty early in the game. Or you know, it was showing me Magnum bullets pretty early in the game, and that that sets me off that something's not quite right. Um, whatever it is. Um, why is there a hunting rifle in here? Oh, whatever. Let's just get the hell out of there. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> okay. Well. Oh, oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Shit. Totally forgot about the zombies in here. <laughs> I was about to say bye, but those zombies were right there. <laughs> Okay, get back to a safe room, like here, and stop. But thank you for, oh wait, I can save. 
I'm an idiot. I passed this like several times and totally forgot that I, there was a safe place. <sighs> just, it's just me. It's just stupid, stupid me. Stupid, stupid me. All right, well, anyway, I think that's about it um, for here. And we'll get to get some progress in hopefully this time uh, this time the next time around but thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye